All right, all right, all right, everybody. Welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. I got a Sikadara off screen, and we're uh, we're gonna go see what Vetra needs first. Even got some Angar around here. Lovely. Get, get in. There we go. So, we're taking the path down. <clears throat> What's the point in fast traveling there when you can just drive? Enjoy the companion banter. It's pretty damn close, too. Hey, have you tried any Angaran cuisine? Fire roasted spider beetle is the best thing. Wouldn't touch that even if I could digest it. <laughs> well, no one from the Milky Way can really digest it, but trust me, the consequences are so worth it. Also, the roasting doesn't actually kill the beetle, it just makes it angry enough to spit. Oh, Literally. That's terrifying. A meat that makes its own gravy. It was amazing. That's terrifying. And somehow I want to eat this less than when you first started talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's extremely terrifying, because do you still eat it alive? Here we are. You ready? Sure. Yeah. You were right. The view is great from up here. We're not even to the top yet. Come on, I'll race you. A race? Up this cliff? Less talk, more climb. Let's go, Pathfinder. And no jump jets. No one likes to cheat. This isn't fair. You're taller. You have reach. Staying within your limits is no fun, Ryder. Having fun? See, not fair. <laughs> wow, it's all going to be like this, huh? No, better. For 14 months, I wondered if I'd made a mistake coming here and dragging my sister with me. I don't wonder anymore. Boarding the Tempest that day was the best decision I ever made. It's been a wild ride, huh? Wouldn't exchange it for any other. Oh, well, that was real sweet. Though, uh, you know, fleet or free climbing up a mountain is not something I'd like to do. <laughs> Wait, where's the nomad? Over here. All right, so where is PB's side? Right here. Okay. Oh god. So it should just be kind of like around that bend up there. That construct was reported stolen by both the outcasts and the collective. Hostility, likely. Yeah, we, we figured that out the moment they started shooting at us. Defeat the outlaws. Looks like we couldn't avoid a fight today. Well, well. Looks like outlaws are camping this site. None of that, please. Thank you. There we go. <laughs> Just stop them from moving. Oh, that's fast. Right. 
Where is find it? the piece of tech PB needs. Am I getting closer? Closer or farther? Farther. Well, I'm sure this isn't it, but let's get what's in here anyway. Where the hell is it? Am I blind? Not over here. Is it on top of one of these things? What the hell? Is it in here? No, it's not in there. It's not in the usual spot. Because it's usually right here. Is it in here? No. But I am inside of a crate now. Oh, hello. Checking this container. Meet PB and Kadar port to acquire. Empty? But there's a data pad. Looks like there's a message for us. <laughs> Hope my boys put up a fight, but you're too slow, Pathfinder. I got what you're looking for. I'll meet you and your Asari at Kadara Port. You can buy the tech from me. Out. I need that piece, Ryder. Guess we've got a date with an annoying outlaw who fancies himself a rival. Yeah, let's uh, let's go meet him. Maybe we can shoot him. <laughs> nope. God damn it. I just realized you weren't on the Natanis, and you don't act like them. You're right. I'm not a citizen. I was taken from Palavin real young. Didn't even get to boot camp. A real Turian might look down at me. And so, you know, I'm using my mother as the example of real Turian. Ooh. I don't remember much about Palavin, but I remember her. She always looked like she was shitting a tank. <laughs> Ew. That must be absolutely terrible. I couldn't imagine having a parent like that. All right, let's find this Krogan. Is he up here? No, he's. It says he's down. Yeah, fuck it. Whatever. Let's just follow the waypoint. Did someone waiting for that Krogan to show? Just need to buy the Rem Tech piece off him so I can perfect my remnant scanner. He and his crew keep showing up at sites we're targeting. It can't be coincidence. I think they could be following us somehow. Just like the lag just followed you? That makes sense. It would be nice to know for sure. I'm working on it. Ryder, come in. We've got a problem. Go ahead, Kalo. We've had an intruder. Got on board and into PB's quarters. Her bot is gone. Pock? How the fuck did they get on? How the hell did that happen? Not sure. Someone knew what they were doing. They left an impressive piece of rem tech and a recorded message, relaying it now. Ryder, it's Kalinda Terev. Pelisari is... well, whatever she calls me these days. Please tell her thank you for the nifty bot. I trust the rem tech piece my crew took will be adequate payment? Oh, and no need to wait for my Krogan friend, Kranit. He and his outlaws work for me. <sighs> Shit! Why can't she just leave me alone? I take it you were lovers? Why? Think she's fixated or something? Ugh. To complete my scanner, I need access to the storage device in Pock. Kalinda's always been a troublemaker. Anything for a rise, and if there's a profit in it, all the better. I'm sorry you're catching her crap now, Ryder. You don't have to deal with this. I'll take care of it on my own, I promise. You see, but we do. She broke into my ship. Hey, we're in this together. Uh, thanks. When I have a lead on getting Pock back, I'll let you know. <sighs> Bitch stole my bot. Okay. How the fuck did she get in there? 
Seriously. I know they just didn't mistake her for PB. The hell was that? Okay, down we go. Hey, Vetra. What's going on? Be careful, Ryder. I know you think you've got an ally in the charlatan, but he's already lied to you once. Oh, I'm definitely keeping an eye on Kadara politics. I'm not going to be used or blindsided. Good to hear. Anything you need, just holler. All right. Now let's get the hell out of here. All right, the Tempest is square. Probably need to check my email. Oh, Ryder, really? No. Could we talk a moment? Sure. What's up? I don't believe it. Gills reconfigured our entire nav array. O'Connell risked a dozen spacewalks putting that in place. Damn it! Callow, don't take the helm. I've had enough of this. Oh shit. You don't give a damn what my team and I went through to build this ship. No, I don't. I care about us surviving out here, and if that means redesigning... You don't have the right! Knock it off, both of you! Sure. Once he gets off my back about how I work on the Tempest... You weren't here. We had to get all kinds of new tech working in a single starship. Fifty hours shifts, epiphanies, accidents. Humans can forget. Salarians can't. To me, it's all still happening. My team is here. Stripping down the Tempest like some broken radio risks everything they suffered to build. Their legacy. If he had the Tempest up on blocks, I might see it. Look, Callow, your people did a great job, but they're dead. And they couldn't have anticipated half the problems in Helios. Like the Scourge. If we don't adapt, we'll die too. Is that what you want their legacy to be? Gutting a complex ship out in space isn't adapting. It's irresponsible and disrespectful. Okay, both of them are correct. I would ra definitely rather you don't do it out in the middle of a flight but we more or less do need to adapt. See, I wish I knew what both of these options would be. The Tempest is ours now. She has to serve our mission first in whatever capacity we need. Gil, change whatever you have to. I wonder, in time, will strangers be treating your achievements so carelessly? Peace and quiet, finally. Thanks, Ryder. Okay, show's over. Back to it. Let's go talk to him. Hello? You have a A foolish thing to get angry over, isn't it? I suppose the Tempest is just like any other ship. To be taken apart and put back together. Or she will be, once Gil's had his way. Gil's upgrading the Tempest, not scrapping her. She's in good hands. I wish I could believe you, but perhaps... <sighs> Anything else? I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Okay. Hey, Sylvie. Feeling all right. You were clinically dead for a few seconds. I didn't even know a Sam could do that. I didn't either. Imagine how I felt. <laughs> I'll bet. 
Death is the only exit, not the most reassuring words to hear. Anyway, thank you, Sam, for saving Ryder's life. You're welcome, Dr. Anwar. We'll talk later. I should get back to things. Sounds good? Oh, okay. I wonder if everybody has an option to talk about the fact that I died on a mission. PB. Hey, are you okay? I shudder to think what the Archon meant to do with you. I heard you had to die to get out of a trap. I think of myself as daring and death-defying, but you... You are daring. I had to up my game. Well, you win. <laughs> Jackass. <laughs> Just don't get yourself exalted, okay? That asshole means to catify us all. Can't let that happen. But he's close. He's almost figured out Krogan. It's the scariest thing. Ugh. Let's talk about something else, okay? I like it when you flirt. I wouldn't want you to stop. Have I flirted with you? <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I'm relentless. It relaxes me. All right. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. All right, so we all we got to do now is go back to the Nexus. Now orbiting Kadara. Got a few things to do here. Look in relatively good shape. Okay. Hello. Oh. Jay. Hakeem, Kerry's producer. I'm the one making you look stunning for the documentary. Right. There's a hitch. Kerry's been arrested for conspiracy to incite unrest. She's in a cell at the militia headquarters. Any chance you could stop by? Oh, a yeah. visit from you might shake things up. Yeah, definitely. Remember, Kerry's down in the militia cells. We got a couple of things to do here, but we're going to take care of this first. Hakeem said they arrested you over the documentary. Guess I tweaked the lion's tail too hard. They didn't hurt you, did they? Nothing's hurt except my dignity. A crowbar, some gum, a nudge from Sam, and I could get you out. I'm right here, hero. Trust me, this is safe in the next aisle. You know, they've had other people in the cells. Rioters, people crying and scared. Me and my truth did that to them. So you're just going to sit there? This is how your work ends? What? No. Hell no. 
Maybe I could use this. But thanks for coming, Ryder. I I'll send word if anything changes. All right. And that's on hold. I can't believe it. You're free. Oh, Pathfinder, we have you to thank. Yes. I'm glad you did the right thing, Ryder. You'd better live a clean life, Nilkin. Or else... What? What does she mean by that, love? I'll tell you later. Let's just get home. Okay. Um, let's see. What else is there here? Speak to leadership. Let's actually... Let's check the journal. Um, wait. That's on hold. Investigate catch ships on Elodin. I should probably do that. But let's check the Nexus. Okay, so not much. Alright, let's investigate the catch ships on Elodin. I'll come back to the Nexus way after. I know it probably doesn't make too much sense to do that, but hey, why not? I don't want to start anything that I can't stop <laughs> uh, before I do this mission. Right, let's select it again. Going back to this damn dust ball. I swear this keeps happening. It's like it's like Tatooine and Jakku all over again. Like. Why does everybody want to go to this desert wasteland in the middle of nowhere? Exit first. Got a lead. All right, let's talk to her. On Kadara. Never mind. All right, let's go uh, do this thing on Elodin then. just like have a conversation on the ship that makes more sense right because it's not like we left her on Kadara land disembark uh, who do we have we got PB and Vetra that works Pathfinder this site could support an initiative outpost Yeah, it's probably like up there. That sucks ass. 
Okay, where is the next? Not the Nexus, dear lord, the Nomad. Too many end names. Baby, you okay? You were making a face. Don't tell anyone, but I'm still finding sand from Eos in my pants. <laughs> Yeah, sure, from Eos, not the other desert world we visited a few times now. Smoke in the distance. Probably the crash ship we're looking for. I'll see you. you can get up there. Get up there, Nomad. Walking. Cats killing other cat. cat. Oh shit! Seeing them fight each other makes me stupidly happy. I know it's actually pretty nice. <laughs> Little civil war going on. Mass Effect and drama civil war. And that, as they say, is that. What's this? It appears to be a cat data log pathfinder. It may contain saved data of some variety. Okay. Can we access this data, Sam? The device is locked. When has a simple lock ever stopped you, Sam? Come on, hack this thing. Pathfinder, it is not just a simple lock. We have never encountered a cat device with security like this before. I suggest we bring it back to the Tempest for further analysis. All right. We could work on it with Dr. Anwar. Sounds good. We'll so talk to Sylvie about it. Right, let's get back to the Nomad. See what's up. Why this thing has to be so damn difficult to get up hills. Sylvie, what do we got? It's almost unbelievable that some of the cat would be fighting their own. The cat always seems so monolithic, almost faceless. I wish we saw more of that fighting. Wouldn't shed a tear if they wiped themselves out. Whatever they've done, they're still a unique, fascinating species. It's hard for me to wish them all dead. Anyway, about this cat device you found by their destroyed ship, it's secured with a biometric lock that can only be activated with a specific genetic code. So, like a fingerprint scan, except with a genetic fingerprint. Exactly. Whatever's in this, it's probably only meant for trusted individuals. So you're saying I have to track down some cat? But that would be impossible, Ryder. Remember those cat genetic samples you scanned on Vault? Lexi's been working on the data, and I have an idea that just might work. We should go talk with her when you have time. I got time now, let's do it. Go down. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. I will deal with that in a moment. Come on, open. Hey, Lex. Let's talk. Got your memo, Suvi. 
Data's right here, but I'm not sure what you're expecting to find. Tell me you have it all sequenced. Yes, of course. It was the first thing I... Perfect. Sam, can you test combinations of sequences against the lock? Testing. Brute force, Dr. Anwar? Tried and true methods. And with Sam's processing speed, it should take no time... Key found. Whoa. We thought it was a data log, but, it, but it's not. It's... It's... Uh... It just locked onto a transmission. Oh shit, turn it off. Oh crap, turn it off! Who knows what it's doing? The device is a receiver. It will not reveal our location. This transmission is... audio. The Archon has abandoned our way. Spurn's tradition defies protocol. He abuses his authority, obsesses over remnant secrets, and keeps us cut off from home. This cannot continue. He will return to the path of right or be destroyed. This is my promise. An Archon stands tall only while we hold him up. Okay. Someone's gunning for the Archon. I'd say that's something we can exploit. You don't mean try to make some kind of deal? Don't know yet. What else is in the transmission? It's the same stuff. It repeats. I, I wonder if there's a way to trace the signal. Scanning for Navpoint. I'll transmit it to your Omni tool, in case you want to check it out. What do you think we'll find out there? I don't know. It might be a base of Ket dissidents organizing against the Archon. Whatever it is, please be careful, Ryder. I will. Locate the source of the signal on EOS. Jesus. Oh, we wiped out all the kit on EOS. Alright, EOS we are. PB might just have to wait <laughs> for a little bit longer. probably wouldn't make a permanent deal with us but if we can get them to help us out and then kick them off the planet that would be just fine Pythia system home of Eos and Prodromos everything's good descent is green Coordinating. Path is calm. What do we got? map it's right up there not too far from colony either jesus Right here, the direct interface. Meaning, I have to go. Oh, lordy, lord, 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 fuck. I have to go right here.
which we've been in here before. Never liked the caves. Too many carcans in your sleeping bag. Loot from our outposts and an Ark escape pod. Where'd they get that? Crap. Do you think they might have found an Ark? We need an up-close scan. We go through this every time we come through here. Can we, can this we... is the nav point Suvi gave us, but there's nothing here. Just this beacon. If I was saying things about my boss, I wouldn't want it to get back to me. This could be some kind of proxy to reduce the chance of detection. What's... Why isn't the log playing? R11 Holor, in need of... of assistance. No longer aware of where it is. Dispose of it. Not feeling bad about killing that guy. Nope, not at all. Track the signal with the second relay. Pathfinder, I have located another node on this network. Updating your Omni tool with the information. Okay. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. Dear Lord Sam, you we know. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. I think that's cat tech. Stay alert. So where exactly is it? Huh. Okay, so we should be able to... Is it in that Maybe the rest of the there? team and I have agreed not to ride you about Kalinda. Good. Believe me, I'm riding myself enough for all of you. Oh, it says it's up. Okay, so where exactly do we get up? This way, maybe? Come on, get up, get up! Not an exact science, but a science nonetheless. <laughs> by some rocks, maybe. I would say we come in peace, but not really. Can't go through there. Can I get up here? There we go. Let's see where this beacon leads us. First, let's get this. I'd assume it leads us over there. Sam, another memory trigger? One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Sam Node on the Hyperion to investigate further. Okay. Pathfinder, I have located another node on this network. Updating your Omni tool with the information. Where is it? Too far from here. Wait, is it that little station over there that I said probably was it? Seems like it is. Bane, oh, we're coming up not. on the barracks. Stay sharp. Shouldn't be as many here as today. No reason to get cocky though. Let's take him out while we're here. Where 
Baron. Are they all down? Look at Vetra giving cover and fun. Hello, who did that? Shoot me if you think you can. Come on, it's okay. Or I guess not. I think that's the last of them. Not bad, little duck. Not bad. That is seriously the worst nickname. Well, you, you can stop calling me that. I'm not gonna fuck around with Bane and his ducklings. I think I see something off in the distance. Among all this green dust. What would you call it, Turkle? I don't know. <laughs> Gotta be going all the way out in the boondocks. Give you a run for your money. Where's the shotgunner? Keep shooting at yourself. Keep shooting yourself. Okay, you douche. Looks like that's it for hostiles. Let's see what this beacon has for us. Okay. Where are we headed? Up here? There we go. Pathfinder, this area can be mine. I, I knew it was coming the moment I tried to travel to I understand, Sam. Thank you. There's an entire base there. We've been over here before. They must have set that up after we murdered all the Rokar. <laughs> Come on, you can get over the hill. You got it. I believe in you. Probably go around this way. It'd be a little rough given getting over these hills, maybe not. Hello, boys. I miss climbing for fun. Everything's l The transmission is strong and unobstructed here, Pathfinder. Oh, I almost thought they weren't gonna shoot it.
There we go. Got you pinned down, huh? Please tell me he's gonna die from fall. Enemy down. All right, keep on your toes. We don't know who else is in here. Exaltation lifted our ancestors out of sorrow and tribulation. This noble gift now allows us to raise others and share in the genetic bounty of this galaxy. But the Archon would selfishly hoard what Helios has to offer. Recorded messages? Sounds like some kind of motivational speech to the Ket. Yeah, that's what happens when you got a rebellion brewing. The Archon does not serve Kent interests, only his own. He wastes our time on the Remnant, but keeps all knowledge for himself. These are the acts of a traitor, not true Kent. Okay. It's just a door outside, yeah. The Archon believes Meridian will bring him power. He will become the master of the remnant, its sole master. Once Helios submits, where does the traitor turn his gaze? Think. Understand. Our home is in peril. Shit, okay. Well, we found it. This looks like a comm console. It's probably what's sending out the messages. There must be more here. This can't be it. And so you have found me. You are a single-minded creature, Pathfinder. I see it now. Your determination will grant the Ket dominion over this galaxy. Not on my watch, asshole. This posturing benefits no one. Our confrontation is inevitable, not imminent. I did not reveal myself as a traitor easily. I did so only because I seek a mutual benefit. Getting rid of the Archon. The Archon's obsession with the Remnant incites chaos and endangers all we've worked for. This must end. Still not seeing how I don't benefit from chaos within Ket ranks. Because it means the Archon lives and challenges you for Meridian, which you desire. I need only ensure nothing stands between you and your target. Once he is cut down, the Remnant will cease to be a concern. We will complete our purpose here and leave. Exaltation? Pass. One day you will be family. Till then, fight if you must. But I offer a reprieve from this conflict, so you can destroy a mutual enemy. Take it. We'll need all the help we can get. Well, well, well. Holy shit. Okay. So... They're offering just to, like, leave us the fuck alone. While we kill the Archon, probably give us some time to recover. In the meanwhile, and then a full-fledged war. Fuck it. It's a good as deal as any as we're gonna get from them. <laughs> so that's it, that's all. Um wait, nope. What was it? Is it under allies? Yes. Let's go back to the Tempest. Ascent is go. Leaving Atmel. All clear. And I suppose this is something we can bring up to Nexus leadership when we finally return. <laughs> and, you know, deign to speak any to anybody other than, like, a couple of reporters and some militia officers. <laughs> All right. All systems green. Sweet. All right, so let's get the hell out of here. Why is there no sound?
That's weird. There we go. Okay, and I think we're gonna follow up with PB when we return. So, I thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. If you're on YouTube, please like, comment, subscribe on Twitch. Uh, drop me a follow if you haven't already, and I will see you all in a moment.